Hi, my name's Tim. I'm here at Cut and Grind uh, for my very first beard trim and uh, haircut with Davide. What are we doing today? Um, I'd like, if possible, to just tidy up the beard. Um, if, do you think you can kind of get a bit of a disconnect going between the moustache and the beard? I can do it. So, a bit like it. Carlos, with the way that his moustache is a bit more prominent. Yeah, we can work around the moustache with a, with a clipper. Mm -hmm. Going a little bit shorter around here. Yeah. yeah. Not too much here, because as you can see, it's not thick as here. No, no. So, we can work yeah, underneath the moustache. Yeah. Not too much here. Yeah. And the cheek. In terms of the cheeks, I kind of like to keep it that soft line, so not, not hard, sharp lines, okay. a little bit more natural and, and softer line on the cheek. Um, and would you like to trim yeah. your length here? I, I was going to say, if we could take a little bit of weight out from this sort of area here, because it does feel a little bit heavy, if that makes sense. Okay. And how would you like to have it here? Straight line or a little bit faded? A little bit or? faded, I think, yeah, yeah. My recommendation is have a straight line mm -hmm. and maybe work okay. into your longest part here. Sure. Hmm? Yeah, yeah, you do that. Yeah, that sounds good. Alright, and what about your haircut? In terms of hair, if we could go for sort of quite short on the sides uh, and on the back, and then I, I normally have it quite long at the front, which okay. I'll either sweep back or quiff up. Are you used to wear a side part here, isn't it? Yes, yeah, yeah. It does that whether I like it or not, so I may as well. A little bit of sectioning. Can you see the difference? Yeah, yeah. Minimal, minimal, minimal. You know what I mean? Also, the thing is with this type of hair, somehow. All right, we're starting with we are starting with one and a half. Very slow, and then it finishes. Like a quite slow, and low fade. All right, now from one and a half, we are going. We start we blend in to the top, scissor over comb. Obviously, this kind of haircut, the fade has to be low. Why? Because we need length for the side part to push it down. And obviously, it cannot be with not the same level of the blending. Both Disconnected. Sides. Disconnected, yeah. Disconnection. How much can I cut from the top? I think we could go uh, about yeah, about that. Maybe a little bit more if you think it needs it. It's not that you need because if we stay on the into the shape of the haircut. Mm -hmm. This length here. You think it's good at the moment? Can go, you know. Okay. But if you, if you, I mean, obviously, are very, very heavy now. So cutting a little bit of the length as well. Mm -hmm. It's gonna make your your fringe, your top, a little bit lighter. Mm -hmm more easy to style it, okay. a little bit more volume yeah, as yeah. well, so, hmm? yeah, go for it. Yeah. Yep. Done? Yep. No, no, I've changed my mind. Blew it back. <laughs>
what's happening is this is all falling forward. Yeah. So I just want it to. Oh, you want to wire it up? Yeah, yeah, that would be inspired. That's fine. Without the length of the door. We're going to do taper, the neckline. Three zero, half, five. And then we work with a different number. This is number one. We are not gonna cut a lot of length here on the sides. Otherwise we are going to lose all our color of our beard. Alright, we didn't spoke we didn't speak before about this different this corner that actually is our goal to grow as our customer told us we want to grow the length into this line here so what can i do now is not to go up with the line but leave as much as we can this part here i mean as we have and going to fill it up just this corner of of the length just this line here blend it up and actually i don't know maybe i'm gonna cut just the wispy hair that are going out but not not too much of the length mm -hmm. because for going there on our line that we got it's pretty much half an inch one centimeter that we have to grow a little bit more your beard but obviously thicker as, as, as we can so let's see i'm gonna do it first of all the fade here and then we check it together and we decide how to do it then yeah good Let's have a look. It's all right. Obviously, ah. it's not down as the part of the four. Yes, yeah, yeah. But it's a work that we have to build together. Yes. So step by step, we're going down, 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 down. Yeah, grow it, grow it longer in, in the... Now it's blended up. Mm -hmm. As you can see. Go with that second time, line, yeah. I'm going to blend it a little bit more down, down, mm. down, down, until you have the square shape that it that you want. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It feels a lot lighter as well, which is nice. We're gonna use four vices oil, just a few drops. And 
just buy one ticket and it, 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 you get one pound. Yeah, you can go everywhere. Now that you're done with this video, head over to our shop and treat yourself to some fine beer brand products. If you're not already a subscriber, be sure to hit that button and keep on watching some more of our awesome videos.